Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. So if you are the kind of person who lives by your to-do list and loves optimizing your day, so when I say this little tablet has completely changed the way I organize my life, I mean it. The iFly Tech AI Note Air 2 is like having a personal assistant, a paper planner and an AI brain all in one. Let me show you how I actually use it to stay focused and get more done. First of all, a big thank you to iFly Tech for sponsoring this video. So let's start. So first of all, let's talk about meetings, especially the kind where everyone's talking fast. There are too many ideas flying around and by the end, you remember none of it. This tablet does real time voice to text and it works in multiple languages too. For example, you want to record a meeting. You can select this record option. It will start audio recording. And in the meantime, you can also take your notes using your pen and here it will show you the live transcription of your audio recording you can also add tags so here we have this tag option so if i select it and here you can see a new tag has been added the best part is it will show you this radar chart so you can identify the position and unique sound wave of each individual the next feature is about translation. So you can do live translation inside this recording section. So you have to select these three dots and then from here you have to select add mode and then you have to select this add option and then you can add translation mode. So you have to select your language. For example, I want to translate from French language. So I will select this French language and then I want to translate into English language. So I will select English language from here and then I will select confirm. So you can see the translation mode has been added. Now I will go back from here and then I will select this menu. So I will select uh, this arrow from here and then from here I will select this translation and then I will select French to English and then I will select this translation mode and then I will play French language. Le lobe frontal est situé à l'avant du cerveau, juste derrière le front, d'où son nom. C'est l'une des parties les plus importantes du cerveau car elle est impliquée dans de nombreuses fonctions essentielles. So here you can see whatever it says in French language, it will automatically start translating it into English language. So this is really, really amazing. I still love writing by hand like many people do. It helps me think better and writing on this thing, it really feels like paper, super smooth with no delay. And it even converts my handwriting to text, which makes everything more organized. So here I use OCR feature and you can see it will convert my handwriting to text. So this is really, really amazing. The next feature is about click and read. For example, I write down important points during my lecture recording and I want to listen the recording exactly from that point. I will single tap on my handwritten content. It will start playing the recording exactly from that point. For example, I will tap on notes. And now for example, I will tap on brainstem. So this is really, really amazing and this will be really helpful in effective note taking. You can also edit the transcribed text. So for example, I want to edit this text. So I will select this text editing option and then here I can easily edit my text. The best part of this, it has chat GPT built in, which can help you summarize everything. So here we have this chat GPT icon. If I swipe it like this, it will open the chat GPT. And now I can ask about anything. For example, I want to ask about brain anatomy. So I will write over here and then I will send this prompt. So chat GPT will start generating the answer. So I don't even stress about writing everything down 
anymore. I just stay present, jot quick highlights and review later if I missed something. I can also copy the answer. So I will select this stop generation. And now for example, I want to copy this information. I will select this copy icon and then I will close the chat GPT. And then from here, I will open text notes. And now I want to paste that text over here. So I will press and hold it like this. And then I will select this paste option. So the same information is now available inside my text notes. And now I can also edit them and I can also share them. The stylus actually lets me do quick gestures to organize notes. For example, if I press this button, I can draw a star for a focus section. I can also draw a circle for to-do list. So for example, here I draw the circle for to-do list. And now I can also draw a triangle to create a title directory. So this is really amazing. This stylus also has pen pressure sensitivity. For example, if I select this brush tool and now I want to draw a line, so I will start putting extra pressure and you can see the line is thick. And now for example, if I start putting less pressure, so you can see the line become thin. So this will be really, really helpful for your drawings. At the back side of this stylus, we have this eraser. So you can use it to erase anything inside your notes. You can also attach this stylus with this tablet. So it will attach to the right side and it will attach magnetically. The best part is it does not need any charging. You can also use iFlyTech AI Note mobile app. All of your notes are automatically synced. So you can access all of your notes through this mobile app. So I will open this mobile app and here you can see I can access all of my notes. You can also open these notes. You can also play your recordings, but you cannot write or edit. So I use the built-in planner to map out my week, set reminders and block focus time. It's all in one place. So I'm not juggling five different apps just to get through Monday. So here we have this schedule section and you can see this calendar. You can extend it to week and you can also extend it to month. You can also add a new schedule. For example, I want to add a schedule for 20th April. So I will select the date and then from here I will select new schedule and then here you can write down the details. So for example, I will write here study and then I will select confirm. So you can see a new schedule has been added. You can also set reminders. So you have to select this icon and then from here you can add reminders. You can also extend the deadline from here and then you can select confirm. On left side, we have this to do list option. Then here we have this focus star section and at bottom we have this weekly overview for all of your notes and recordings. You can also scan your documents using this e-ink tablet. So at the back side, we have this document scanning camera. So if you want to scan a document, so here we have this document scanning option. So I will select it and here you can see I have different documents I already scanned. So if you want to scan a new document, you can select this create a new scan. For example, I already scanned this document. So I will open this document. You can also use your stylus and then you can write on your scan document as well. You can also highlight text inside ebooks. For example, I want to highlight this paragraph. I will select this draw a ticket option and then I will select this paragraph. You can see the whole paragraph is selected. You can select this highlight option and now the whole paragraph is highlighted. You can also listen to your ebooks. You just have to tap in the middle like this. It will show you this headphone icon. You can select it and then it will start playing this ebook. So here you can see it start playing this ebook. Now, for example, if you want to pause it, you can easily pause it from here. So you don't have to use all these features, but they are there when you need them. 
So honestly, this isn't just a productivity tool, it's kind of a lifestyle shift because now I spend less time organizing and more time actually doing. If your brain runs a mile a minute like mine and you love a good handwritten list but still want the speed of AI, this might just be your new secret weapon. If you find this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments which feature impressed you the most. So this is for today's video. Please subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much.